What is up guys, Christian here. Today I will show you how to unlock any Motorola phone out there. Now as many of you know already, uh, Lenovo recently acquired Motorola, so this method will also work for any Lenovo or Motorola phones out there. My phone is currently locked to AT&T, but I want to unlock it to use it with my Metro PCS SIM card. But after you unlock it, you will be able to use it with T-Mobile, Vodafone, Rogers, or any other GSM carrier in the world. Now it is extremely simple, we're gonna do it together step by step. I'm gonna be using uh, this phone, which is a Moto E, second generation. And all you need to unlock your device is your computer, your phone, and a SIM card. Okay, it is extremely simple. Now before we proceed, I have to mention that unfortunately it is not free, but trust me guys, it is well worth it to have a fully factory unlocked phone that is compatible worldwide with all carriers. All right, with that said, we're finally ready to begin. So we're gonna get the IMEI number of the phone. That's the first step. So to get the IMEI number of the phone, go to your dial pad, just as if you were dialing a call, and type the following command. Type star hash zero six hash. As you will see, your 15 digit IMEI number will appear in your screen. This is very, very important. Keep this number confidential, keep it somewhere close, because based on this number, we will generate the unlock code to unlock this phone. All right, so the next step takes place in a computer. So open your internet browser and go to the website unlockriver.com. Now in this website, we will request the unlock code to unlock this phone. All right, so we just need to fill in here all the information. Uh, we're gonna start by selecting the original carrier and country that your phone is currently locked to. This is the place where you bought it. So in this case, my phone is currently locked to AT&T United States. So just go ahead and select that one. Great. Now uh, you're gonna select here, you select the brand of your phone. So we're gonna look for Motorola or Lenovo. So in this case it's Motorola. And then, then we're gonna select the exact model. So in this case, I'm gonna be unlocking a Moto E. Perfect. So I'm gonna select that one. And the next step is the most important one. Here you will have to enter your 15 digit IMEI number. That's the number we got at the beginning of the video, remember? So go ahead and enter it here. Make sure it is 100% correct. Very, very important. Great. Now, the last step is to enter your email where you wanna receive your, your um, customized unlock code. So write down here your email, make sure it is 100% correct because they will send you your unlock code to this email, all right? Perfect. So once you have filled everything, go ahead and click unlock now. You will see the average delivery time and the price to unlock your phone. All right, so in the following screen, you will see a summary of your current order. So just check everything here, make sure it is 100% correct. You will see the average delivery time, the price to unlock your phone, and all the information you need to know before unlocking your phone. All right, so once you have read everything, go down and select your payment option and complete your order. So I'm gonna do it and I'll see you in a few seconds. Perfect, so if you did everything correct, you will see a screen just like this, saying that your order was placed and received successfully. So here, uh, basically it says that they will email you your unlock code. So you have to check your email, and uh, as you can see, it takes one to 72 hours in this case. Uh, in some cases, it's very quick, it takes five minutes. In some other cases, it takes up to three business days, so be very patient. So I'm gonna show you my personal email account so that you can see how the email will look like after you have received it. So I use Gmail. And as you can see here, I just got uh, my confirmation and the actual unlock code. It says your Motorola unlock code is ready. So we're gonna go ahead and open this email. All right, so as you can see here, it says your Motorola unlock code is ready. So once you get this notification, you will also get instructions on how to insert the unlock code. And of course, the most important part, the actual unlock code down here. So they have sent us two different unlock codes. We're gonna try both, but I'm gonna show you how to insert your unlock code into your phone. Now keep in mind that this is a unique code and will only work for your phone, which is calculated based on the IMEI number. All right, so once you have your unlock code ready, go ahead and power off your device. So once your phone is completely off, we're gonna go ahead and insert a non-supported SIM card. So in this case, my phone is currently locked to AT&T. So I'm gonna have to insert a different SIM card that is not from AT&T. So um, this is my original SIM card here. So I'm gonna use a non-supported SIM card uh, in this case can be Metro PCS, T-Mobile, or any other GSM carrier. So I'm gonna go ahead and insert my Metro PCS SIM card. Okay, so once you have inserted successfully, go ahead and power on the device. In the meantime, we're gonna go ahead and put it here, and we will put back the frame here. And we're just gonna wait a couple of seconds until the phone is completely on. Now, once the phone uh, recognizes that it has been turned on with a non-supported SIM card, 
it will require an unlock code in order to use it with that SIM card. So that's where we need to insert your unlock code. So once your phone is on, you will see the message network locked or no service or uh, it requires an unlock code. Any of those messages means that your phone is currently locked. So we will go ahead and insert the unlock code. So just swipe to unlock and it says SIM network unlock pin. Perfect. So we're going to go ahead and insert the unlock code we received in the email. Okay. So we're going to carefully enter it here. One, four, six, nine, four, two, seven, two, one. Hit OK. And once we hit unlock, you will see a success message. Network unlock successful. Perfect, guys. That means that your phone was unlocked successfully and now we are ready to use it with any carrier, any GSM SIM card worldwide. It is as simple as that, guys. The phone is now fully factory unlocked and now is compatible worldwide with all carriers. Thanks for watching, guys. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section down below. And don't forget to subscribe. We upload really cool videos every week. Thanks for watching. See you next time.